you did this, I just did this, turn a multi-thousand dollar camera into a paperweight, how do we recover it and put it back into service? Now, whether you're loading up the latest Magic Lantern firmware or updating your Canon to the latest Canon firmware, sometimes stuff just happens and you brick your camera. After everything's said and done, you turn it on and nothing happens. There's no lights, no nothing. How do you recover it and put it back into service? There's a couple steps to it, but first, if you like and enjoy my content, if it's very helpful to you and you want to learn more, go ahead and like, comment and subscribe and come back for more tech tips more camera stuff and at some point very soon mechanical engineering let's get to it step one remove the battery step two if you have sc cards cf cards remove those step three pop off the lens and now for step four the big one you're gonna need a small precision style screwdriver like you might use for doing your glasses open up the side panels right here and you're gonna see a little screw remove this little screw and now with that screw set aside this compartment has the cmos battery it's a similar battery to what you find in a computer or a laptop this is what helps keep the time date and boot settings on computers and on cameras remove that and now you're going to let your camera sit for at least 30 seconds to a minute while we're waiting what is your favorite photo that you've ever taken or what's the favorite photo you've ever seen online let me know in the comments below now that a minute maybe you know a little bit longer has passed whatever you feel is comfortable take your cmos stick it back in and put that screw back in right away so you don't lose it if you realize that the time and date keep failing on your camera you are going to want to replace that battery now i can't guarantee if this will work on canons and nikons or if this will solve your situation but it may not be a bad time to replace that battery like this camera is from 2013 i've had it for over 10 years now now that's back in go ahead close the flaps reinstall the lens you don't need to put the SD cards in, but you do need to put the battery back in. Close the flap for the SD cards, and if all goes well, you're going to get to the point where you can reset the time and date. And from this point forward, enjoy using your camera. You can retry to do the firmware update. If it fails again, just follow the same steps, or you can try to reload Magic Lantern again and use that for whatever it's worth. This has been Lance, the Ultimate Postman. Again, if this helped you out in any way, a like and a comment is appreciated. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more camera, tech tips, and sometime soon, hopefully, some mechanical engineering, and of course, Ultimate Frisbee content.